Hello everyone, Wildstone here and welcome to another video. So this happened to me uh, early hours this morning and um, with help of uh, Brightech09 I uh, actually figured out how uh, to solve it. He actually done a video um, on an overall so check his channel out to see that. But uh, this year I was getting the error X, uh, OX800FO922 and that was on this particular update, the KB5012170. And as you can see here, this is a secure boot update. And um, that's the key thing here. I'm going to show you literally how we solved it on a nice quick video here. So I, what I'll do now is I'll just uh, hit retry here and we'll show you what's actually happening. So hit and retry now. Check in for Windows. There we are, so installing, 0%, 20%, and it'll literally zoom all the way through that, and uh, you'll see it now, so 1996, and if you're getting this, this is how you solve it. Download error, and it gave you the code of what I just showed you just now, and there it is. So, what you gotta basically do is turn off secure boot. That is it. So what you want to do is you want to go uh, restart the system and go into your uh, system BIOS and turn it off. I will uh, link this up to the other computer and I'll show you what I did. So unfortunately, uh, HDMI output doesn't work on a laptop, so I'm going to record this uh, via the screen on my phone. So what you want to do is you want to find your boot options. Uh, this is an old laptop. Yours will be completely different, but in boot options, you'll see secure boot. All you want to do is you want to disable this and then you basically uh, press your key to save and exit for me it is f10 see exit save and changes and then just hit yes and let it reboot right so once uh, secure boot is uh, disabled just come back into the windows update as you can see here and just retry the update or check for updates uh, if it says check for updates here uh, for me it's retry and here we go, checking for updates again. And there we go, uh, you'll see at the bottom here, it is downloading. It looks like it's also found another download for me at the moment, but this is the one we're looking at at the moment. And we'll just uh, zoom through this video and let this uh, download. And there we go, we're almost complete and done. No errors popped up. So I will continue to let the, uh, the first one go. So that is how you um, basically install that update. It is for secure boot. For some reason, Microsoft won't allow you to do it uh, you, uh, without disabling uh, secure boot. How the average uh, user is going to know that is beyond me. I don't know what Microsoft is thinking. But anyway, if this video was helpful to you, give it a thumbs up, leave the comments down below. Uh, side note, don't forget now to go back into your BIOS and turn Secure Boot back on. And then thank you very much to my Patreon subscribers. Their names will be at the top right hand side of the screen right now. And um, I'll catch you all in the next video. Ciao for now everyone.